years, and for the first two years, I didn't dare talk to him. I mean, we had him up on this pedestal. But a lot of people don't know he had a great sense of humor. He would have this little, this little wry grin on his face, and uh, uh, I got so I liked to entertain him. I, when he was getting worked on on the trainer's table, I would get under the table and present I was Peter Graves from Mission Impossible, and I would give him his orders for that day. And he'd be up there, he'd be up there giggling a little bit. So uh, I wish more people could have gotten closer to him to know him personally better, uh, because there was separation obviously between a fan and an athlete. But uh, he was unbelievable, and his legacy, but some 45 years later, lives on. That is so unique. That will tell you that a legacy that lasts that long tells you about the man, not just the ball player.